All right, well, back to Old Man Tech. We're going to install um, Cody on the new uh, second generation Amazon Fire Stick. Uh, I'm sorry, Fire TV Stick. Uh, this is, like I said, the second generation. Uh, I'm going to make sure that it does work on here. People are saying that they don't think it does because you can't install some of the uh, some of the stuff. Well, let's let's go ahead and do it. This is going to be the first time I tried, so uh, you know, bear with me. But uh, just follow my uh, follow my moves, and you'll be able to do it. First thing I want to do though is go down to settings. Uh, in settings, if you go to system, um, there's some things you want to, uh, right there, go to developer options under system. There's a couple things here I want to go ahead and turn on. Uh, first, I want to do apps from unknown sources because when we um, when we download Kodi from Kodi.tv, um, it, it needs to know this because it's not coming from the actual Amazon store, app store. So let's go ahead and turn that on. We're going to say OK to that. And also, I want to go ahead and install this because there are a few things in Kodi that won't work correctly if this isn't on. So let's go ahead and just say on to that, and let's get out of here. Now, that uh, that unknown sources thing, there is a warning saying that you know you could accidentally download something that may have viruses and everything. Kodi is fine; um, we've used it for quite a few, quite a long time, so there's no problems with any kind of viruses if we go straight for to the uh, the Kodi TV. So let's go ahead and. Now let's do the first step, which is in order to be able to reach it, to be able to reach um, Kodi.tv, we have to install something that has a browser. Browser. Now there is a program called ES File Explorer that everybody seems to use. I was told that it's no longer available um, by some people that watch some of the videos, so let's go ahead and see if it is. First we're going to go search. We're going to go over here and type in E. Yes. Now, like I said, this is the very first time on this um, Fire Stick that I've tried this, so we'll see together. Um, there goes. There's ES Explorer right there. Let's go ahead and click that and see what we get. Hmm. Sure enough, it looks like it's not there. Let's go ahead and try it again. ES. F. I. L. E. E X P L There it is. So if you click the whole thing, ES File Explorer and select it, it will come up. So for those of you that can't find it by putting in ES Explorer, um, just like I said, put ES File Explorer, and then it doesn't seem to search and find it. But if you collect what you uh, collect, uh, select what you just typed in, it will come up. So let's go ahead and select that. Sure enough, here it is. So let's go ahead and select Download. Give it just a second to download. Okay, so it has uh, downloaded and installed. So uh, let's go, get out of this, go back to our main menu. Click home, go right back. So now if we go into, well, there's the recent, but if you go down to your apps, it should be in there. There it is. And I'm going to add my favorites just so I know where it is. So let's go ahead and uh, go to it. So like I said, this is new. So let's go ahead and uh, let me do this for a second here. Alright, so let's go, what we want to do is go over here. Now this ES Explorer is a little weird when it comes to the main, there it is. It's kind of hard to see what's being selected, but uh, you can see over there the gray boxes. Let's move it over here and go to favorite, go to add. We want to add a URL uh, that we can get to. We're going to add, uh, where are we at? HTTP colon forward slash forward slash uh, where's it at k o d i dot <laughs> tv and we're going to say next we're going to call it something let's go ahead and call it Cody 
All right, hit next. And yes, we want to add it. So again, it's kind of hard to do it with the controllers, but you can maybe you can see it's highlighted ads so, and click add. All right, so now it did add the bookmark. So let's go ahead and go back to the left, go all the way down there to what we created. There it is. There's the Cody thing there. Shortcut, okay. Go ahead and select that. And over on the right side, the web browser should come up and it should go to Cody.tv. All right, it took a couple seconds for some reason. Maybe it's because of the very first time, but. Uh, um, what is that currently offline? Okay, Cody TV is offline. All right, so now what we're going to do is go over to the Downloads tab, and like I said, it is a little weird the way you control this. So I'm going to go um, right about here and scroll to the. Oh, can't do it. There we go. It's kind of like I said, kind of hard, but just move it around. Eventually, you'll see the square to go ahead, or the rectangle. Go ahead and hit Downloads. All right. If you go, see where we at? Go back up and over till you see something being highlighted again very okay there it is finally going there um, let's go ahead and go down till we see all the installs there we go if you go to the Android logo which you see over there on the right go all the way over you'll see one that says ARM you'll want to get to that one there we go um, again I don't know if you can see that but the the ARM is highlighted go ahead and click that now, what people have told me, you can click that, it doesn't come up. You can click it over and over again, and eventually it will. However, if you click it, then move all the way to the left till the side menu is highlighted. Go, very, go down to the very bottom. Now go all the way to the right where it says More. Select that, and select Open in Browser. There you go. Do I, how do I want to open it? I want to open up with ES Explorer. Uh, we'll say just once. Alright, so now it is downloading Cody. Alright, and we're going to go down to open file, select open file, select it, and we want to go down to install. There's going to be cancel, mark it, and install. Go ahead and hit install. Yes, we go down to the bottom where it says install. All right, let's go down where it says done. You can open it from there, but I'm going to say done. Hit the home button to get out of ES File Explorer. And we're going to go over to our apps. And there's Cody right there. I'm going to go down and hit favorites just to add it for myself. And let's go ahead and select Cody. Here it is, 16.1 Jarvis, uh, the latest version. There is a new version that uh, is in beta right now, beta 5, I think, should be out very uh, shortly, but 16.1 is the latest, um, the latest version. And there you go. As you can see, it's installed. Um, for those of you who had a hard time, please just watch, rewatch the video. You'll be able to. This is the newer version of the Amazon Fire TV stick, and it does work. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching. Peace.